Goble Johnson. It is such an honor to be with you today to present the National Space Grant Distinguished Service Award. This award was established to recognize individuals whose life and career have had a long-lasting impact in a science, engineering, or education field that is related to aeronautics, aviation, or to space endeavors. John Glenn, who called upon you to calculate his orbital trajectories for his 1962 Mercury mission, is a past recipient. Other past recipients have included Dr. James Van Allen, Captain John Young, Neil deGrasse Tyson, Sally Ride, and Bill Nye, the science guy. The National Space Grant Program is a NASA-sponsored program with consortia in every state plus the District of Columbia and Puerto Rico, and we all work on NASA-inspired education, workforce development, and research programs. As Margot Shetterly writes in her book, Hidden Figures, you are a true space pilgrim. You help to write the textbook of space. Space is the place, and you did it in real time. And you did so in times of rampant discrimination against people of color and women. Shetterly notes, the racism stuff, the woman stuff, you managed to tuck it all, all of that, away in a place far from your core where it would not damage your steely confidence. In your 33-year career with NACA and NASA, your technical brilliance and mastery of the laws of physics and mathematics enabled calculations that contributed to the orbital trajectories of NASA's manned missions, the X-15 hypersonic plane, the lunar rendezvous mission, and aspects of the space shuttle and Earth Resources Satellite Programs, among many others. Your research reports describing a method for using visible stars to navigate a course without a guidance computer gave the Apollo 13 astronauts the navigational tools they needed to return safely to Earth when their computer guidance system failed. Your accomplishments, your pioneering spirit, and the grace and dignity you showed in the face of formidable technical and dawning social challenges are an inspiration to all of us. You as a person and your remarkable work are an amazing legacy for the U.S. Space Program and we are so pleased and honored to honor you and your enduring legacy. So congratulations, Catherine. Thank you. And I thought I wanted to tell you that this award is created by a, a very well-known glass artist, Josh Simpson, and it's called the Planets Award, and it's made from blown glass and incorporates intricate Florentine styles um, in, into the design. And he was inspired to create this uh, artwork by the early images of Earth as seen from space. So we hope you will really enjoy having this award. Thank you, Catherine.